papita, papita, eres como una dulce agradable, con ojos encantadores. Papita, papita, eres fortaleza de mi corazón, vives dentro de la tierra. Little Dilma knows full well what treasure lies in the earth, just like everyone else here in Parque de la Papa. In this region, at an elevation of 4,000 meters, six communities work the fields together, just like the Incas did. More than 4,000 potato varieties grow in Peru, but climate change could reduce the number. Some years it doesn't rain during the rainy season. It's too dry. Then it suddenly rains during the dry season. Here they use every type of potato. The compis gets sweeter as it's chewed and provides a good harvest even if it is infected with disease. The cachun mocachina is used to test brides-to-be. If she peels the potato too slowly, the wedding's off. The variety is also of interest to the International Potato Center in Lima. For years they've been collecting as many potato species as possible to store them for the future. Plant parts can survive for centuries in liquid nitrogen. Stored at minus 30 degrees Celsius, potato seeds keep for decades. Scientist Jenny Van Beem examines plants in the in vitro gene bank where they're grown before replanting in the fields. And because over the centuries the tubers from Peru have become the world's third most consumed food product, the scientists can also answer the question, what will people be eating in the future? The answer lies in the variety. We're prepared for every change, whether from pests or disease or climate change. The answer is stored here. These potatoes provide the crop yield we need, the resistance we need, the nutritional value, and the necessary adaptability. The scientists in Lima work closely together with the farmers from the Parque de la Papa in the mountains, who bring in different potato varieties. In turn, the scientists give them tubers and seeds free of disease and the promise of a better harvest. Once a year, there's a big festival, the Day of the Potato. This year, in the community of Paru Paru. Just like centuries ago, it's celebrated with traditional music and dance. The festival gives thanks to Pachamama, Mother Earth, for all she's provided. Each of the six communities brings offerings. And what better way to celebrate the potato than to eat it together? Okay.